Uh, it's a product of the 90s thing. Get off your goddamn phone. What's good? What's good? What's good? It's the product of the 90s vlog channel. I kind of froze a little bit. Like He just a little camera shy, I don't mind him. <laughs> that boy just camera shy. Anthony, look at the camera and crash. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Yo, don't what do that. The <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> this <laughs> got scared for real. Yeah, you got there right? I got scared. Damn, my friend, my pinky ring. You got some pinky ring. Who cares? I got the only ring that ever matters. I got a raccoon so ring on your head. Boy, you mean the ring around your lips? I think if anything, it'll be a good look for us to bring them food. <laughs> I'm telling you, you won't make an impression. Feed them. It's about to be lunchtime. You probably feed them. Y'all trying to go like no. trying to go three ways with me on the pizza? No. <laughs> and we go over there and just eat the whole time and shit. <laughs> Yo, take like six slices out of the pizza and be like, yeah, we bought y'all pizza. Right. Buy one box. <laughs> <laughs> like, we can just be ourselves out there, you know what I mean? Um, if they, they came here to interview us, so they were going to be asking questions. We just answer them thoughtfully, thoroughly, truthfully, honestly, you know, like human I don't beings. Know what you know? Know? What girl trying to get me to do like some feet clean Yeah, pedicure. Yo, to be honest, I've been considering it. I'm gonna try to cut my own toenails. I told my girl, the only way if I can get a small Asian woman to cut my toenails and like make hand love to it, I told I told her two things. Like the only way I'm gonna do is this: you do it with me and you pay for it. I ain't paying for it. <laughs> She was like, all right, yo, like, you pay for it, I go, but, like, I ain't paying Because she know once you go the first time, you're going to keep on going back. Because dudes who tell me they get their toes done, tell me it proudly. They be like, hell yeah. Like, I'm oh, missing out. My toes f***ed <laughs> up. I love to see some Asian lady fixing up my feet real fast. Pull out the saw. I wonder what they do with the toenails. <laughs> yeah, what the f***? They just they storm in your rice. <laughs> some onions. You think it's onions and It's your toenails or something. Nah, they keep yeah. that that's why it'd be so damn good. Yeah, what the? <laughs> Got that flavor. That yeah. toe fungus. Y'all <laughs> so into y'all, so y'all can even tell police. I don't care, bro. We ain't driving. Yeah, we got our seatbelt. Well, I got my seatbelt. I don't got nothing on me. I'm cool. Shit. You see his 12 radar? 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, a couple days ago, Jay still asked us to come down to the studio, and now we're here. And we don't know what to expect, but it's our first time, and it's about to be the best time. It's Kwame Kazi. Um, we're here to do our thing. Exposure for the city, put Buffalo on. That's the goal. That's what we got in mind. Um, next shows, we're going to put our heart out there. Um, missing a couple group members, but it's all good. Probably got a 90 still here, and we represent. All right. That's all you're getting from me, so you it's good. I'm going to just put, that's all you get from him over here. You should put it there. in like a little quotation mark. You cool with being on camera right now? No. Nah, not right now. All right. <laughs> I wish I could have kept this thing rolling the whole time, but he didn't want to be on camera, but it's cool. But um, 15 seconds of playing Master Plan, and he just kind of invited us to way. perform it at one of his spots that he's spending at tomorrow. Well, that is Todd. I mean, DJ Todd. Shout out DJ Todd. What was the first one? Yo, come on, fool. All right, cool. He called me a fool. I feel so gangster. Nah. <laughs> All right. Now, the footage you take it, right? Mm -hmm. What is that for? Just a vlog. Is that okay? Yeah. All right. Um, whoever gets highest numbers, those who usually get caught first for showcasing. Okay. So you want people to share your Yeah. Um, you're here because of Last Hurrah. Last Hurrah. That's crazy. What? The opportunity is pretty much to, to put y'all to the ears that need to hear y'all. Mm -hmm. But as far as y'all getting in regular rotation, a lot of that has to deal with the numbers too. Mm -hmm. So the spotlight is kind of like the alley hoop for y'all, right? So it could be something for clout for a couple of weeks, or you could actually use it to help benefit yourself and get you where you need to be. Yeah. Depending on how you work it. You know what I'm saying? Yo. Yo. Where you going, man? Like, you, sound is, is you got different sounds of shit. Like, what, what's your. What's your goal? My goal, to be honest, as far as music is concerned, is to perform at every major festival, every major stadium that's been sold out by all your songs like this. You still feel like you're trying to find your sound. Yeah, definitely. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing wrong with that. But like this, this is what you lean towards. All the other 
full, you know what I'm saying? But this gonna get you the bag. Wait, the other gonna get you this right here in Weaver One mm -hmm. Air. Tell them what else happened. All right, what else happened? Stay right there, stay right there, stay right there. All right, well, what else happened is um, we pretty much had an extensive conversation about the plans of shooting a video for last arrival. We're gonna keep the details on the down low. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> That's simple, because I play, if I play two or three tracks of yours, it sounds like two different people. Yo, I've been told that to be honest, like, <laughs> but I, the only reason for that is I always try to find a different way to reinvent myself, and that's why I had a team, and we nah, try to make sure that I do it. Sometimes we do too much. Yeah. We go, oh, that sounds good. Let me try this and see if I you find your pocket. This your pocket. Right. Alright, come on. <laughs> Alright. I'm about to get lit real quick. <laughs> yeah, but that's what we have with it. Mmm. Say something on that mic, son. Say something on that mic. Say something on that mic. <laughs> so how long did it take you to get to WBFK and start working as did, um... Wait, what, what's your position here again? Uh, digital managing editor. I do video, Facebook, uh, social media, all that kind of stuff for all the websites. Mm -hmm. Shit, it took me, it took me a minute. Where? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I don't got no yeah. So how long you been here at um, WBOK working for? I mean, that's how I got uh, so I think it'll be two well, years. Uh, two, yeah, two years next month I've been here. Where? How'd you get into it? Don't tell me, buddy. Should I take your job? No, 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 no. 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 I'm tired. Um, <laughs> now, uh, I started with public relations in these streets. <laughs> I told you. Dang. Just roasting people. <laughs> Public relations. <laughs> Didn't somebody hurt me? I went to school for uh, radio broadcasting communications. Right. I came up here for school uh, to play ball at, at Buffalo. Yeah. Which kind of ball? Football? Oh, yeah, no worries. Well, because if you talk about lacrosse, I'd have been like, all right, man. Ain't nothing to brag about. Nah. <laughs> I was young and really ain't know what I wanted to do with myself yet. So I was still doing something I shouldn't have been doing. Um, had my son and then got my shit together. Where kids do that, bro. I'm telling you now. I, my life did a three. Well, I wasn't really going down the wrong path, but I was not going down the wrong <laughs> path. I was flying down the wrong path. Man. But God is good, huh? Mm -hmm. I, I'm one of those stories where they tell you don't do certain stuff. You're just gonna end up in a certain type of way. But I did end up the way they thought I was gonna end up. So uh, never let people tell you what you can't do. All right, all right, all right. We're back at it again. Power Night 3.7. W. Bill Killer People Station. Your boy's still about money. Plug you in. I don't like that. All right, let's settle. Power 93.7, WBLK The People Station. Your boy's still about money. Plug you in to another dish of the 716 Spotlight. Brought to you by Easy... Easy Loan Auto. Easy Loan Auto. You got it, you got it, you got it. Yeah, it's kind of like recording music. Power 93.7, WBLK The People Station. Your boy's still about money. Plugging you into another dish of the 716 Spotlight. Brought to you by Easy Loan Autos. Bow! Um, I feel kind of special today, right? We got these young boys in the building today. Product of the hold 90s. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Bruh. <laughs> <laughs> Easy Loan Auto Sales, only because I know it's an airing client, they're going to be picky about it. Easy what did loan. I say? You said Easy Loan Autos. I hate you, Bill. I know. He doesn't really hate you, Bill. I know he doesn't. He just said use Batman to his Robin. All right, y'all ready? <laughs> oh, Robin to his Batman. Yeah. I would definitely do that. <laughs> 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 Power 93.7, WBLK The People Station. I go by the name Still About Money. Plugging you into another dish of the 716 Spotlight. Brought to you by Easy Loan Auto Sales. I've got goosebumps again, all right? I only get these with special people come up here, Bill, all right? Product of the 90s. What up with y'all boys, man? man you. Chew. Chilling, chilling. <laughs> <laughs> now they all shy and quiet now. Uh, well, we brought you here. Um, I'm going to butcher your name. We're going to go through all the names of all of you in a minute. Uh, VO, I got your track, Last Hurrah. Hey. Dope. Amazing song. Oh, uh, made me feel like I wanted to quit my job. You know, it was one of those songs like, you know what, I'm quitting. I'm about to go live my dream. That's how I felt like when I listened to it. Uh, why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself to the people? Um, my name is Lucero Omar. Um, my Facebook name is Dallas Johnson, just in case <laughs> y'all may not know. Um, but yeah, um, I come from Syracuse, but we out here doing it big in Buffalo. We've been out here for about four years, and honestly, we've been spreading our roots and performing on a constant basis, monthly basis. Um, I'm here with my group product of the 90s. I like um, here's my people over here. I'm Tell just saying your name. Say your name. Light like skins. I'm, I'm Kwamikaze, uh, like uh, representing Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, uh, Syracuse 2. We got some civilians up there. They're pretty good people. Uh, we got. I'm K. Mexi, straight from Syracuse, New York. You know what I'm saying? Okay, okay, okay. Sweet. <laughs> now, um, 
you said your name is Dallas Johnson yeah. on Facebook. So why um, Dallas Johnson for the English people on Facebook, and then Vasasa <laughs> Ronaldo? Uh, for anybody else, why? <laughs> Josh, please Why the switch up? Why the switch up? The switch up pretty much came. Well, um, Dallas Johnson. My mom gave me for them interviews. You know, Daquan Johnson just ain't gonna get hired. They gonna no call back. back. They gonna look at that resume, Daquan. Right. Alicia, I don't know. No, no, you ain't get no call back. You ain't get no call back. My wife kind of helped me figure a name out that I was cool with. Omar came from my middle name, Orsetto, in Spanish for the spokesman. And you know, some with certain things that I've been saying, I feel like I'm a spokesman for people that go through some of the things. Same, go through some of the things. Same, go through some of the things. Go through some of the things. Same things I go through. Bruh. How old are you guys? I'm 24. Two years, King Ray. 21. I'm, I'm 21. 21. So y'all young, young. Because I know some of us old cats, we start to feel like the, the younger generation doesn't really appreciate the music, man. They just mumble over a dope beat. Like, I'm so happy to hear you and be able to hear what you're saying. <laughs> and the fact that you actually put time into your craft and actually take it to the next level, man. Because I hear a lot of music. Yeah. And uh, The Last Arrive, man, gave me goosebumps. So I'm excited to see what you guys are going to do in the future. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so tell people where they can find you out on social media. Um, well, I'm going to start over here. You can find me at Instagram at Volsetto Omar, Snapchat Volsetto Omar, Twitter Volsetto Omar, YouTube Volsetto Omar, <laughs> Facebook Volsetto Omar, the group Product of the 90s. You can find that on Facebook at this moment right now. Go ahead, Maxi. You can find me on Facebook, King Mexi. You can find me on SoundCloud, King Mexi. You can find me on YouTube, King Mexi. You can find me on any social media platform, any music platform at King Mexi. Alright, it's Kwamikaze on Spotify. You can only find me at Kwamikaze. Anywhere else, it's all MF Kwame. I'm LinkedIn. Uh, hit me up for contact. Well, next two weeks, my friend, it's all about you. Front page of the website hey. and the app. Man, I'm so hyped, man. I'm hyped to see what y'all gonna do. And if I don't get a call out for a cameo for this video, I'm gonna block y'all on Facebook. Yep, you know, I'm petty. I'm petty. I'm gonna block y'all movie. I'm joking. <laughs> Thanks for coming out, man. Mama on the radio. Boom. That was dope. Should you some 315 boys? Yeah. Syracuse born and bred. Oh, where? What side of town you from? Uh, Baldwinsville. Bruh. So that's not Syracuse. That's an outskirts. <laughs> All right. I'm my, my, like, I'm going to have to call you. part of Syracuse. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm going to work on the west side for a long, long time. So west side? Time. Yep. All right. Y'all ready? Yes. All right. We're going to do one by one. All right? All right. Say your name. So you're riding with your boy Still Want Money on Power 93.7 WBLK. You got to say Power. All right. Uh, this Volsetto Omar, you cruising with your boy, Jay. I hate black people. <laughs> <laughs> I told this man what to say. I had to put the sauce on it, though. <laughs> and no, uh, just still about money. All right, just all still about right. money. All right. This Volsetto Omar, you right here, was still about money on Power 93.7 WBLK. I like it, I like it. Say it with your chest. That's good. WBLK. <laughs> <laughs> this Volsetto Omar, you... Mm, that wasn't my chest. Alright, come on, King Mexican. <laughs> <laughs> this King Mexican, you riding with your boy still about money on 93.7 BLK. Oh, wait, I said BLK, not BLK. Put the power in it. Put the power in it. Put the power in it, baby. Let's <laughs> try this again. This King Mexi, we out here with your boy still about money on power 93.7 WBLK. I'll fix the rest. Yeah. My man, nice kid number two. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> This Kwamikaze, a product of the 90s, we were still about money, and you listen to Power 93.7 WBLK. I like it, I like it. We really having a good time here. To be honest, it's our first time, and it's the best time for us right now, and it just feel like the start of something great, you know what I mean? And by the way, we don't have deja vu when we walked in here, so it's like it's something that was meant to be, and this was meant to be, so everything feeling right. For once, it's feeling right. <laughs> That's right. my lesson, right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>